A Sunni armed group called Jaysh al Adil has claimed responsibility for last week's suicide bombing, but Iran says it now has evidence the attack was planned from inside Pakistan. Two days ago, we arrested a woman who was our first lead. After interrogating her, we found other links. I can tell you that two of the members of this team were Pakistanis. The suicide bomber was a person named Hafiz Muhammad Ali from Pakistan. A suicide bomber in a vehicle packed with explosives drove into a bus transporting members of Iran's Revolutionary Guards. The Pakistani government has denied the attack was planned from its territory. I think uh, Iran does not have any evidence as to whether that group was operating from Pakistan or it's... Now, these people have relatives right across the border. The three others arrested by Iran are ethnic Baluch minorities. One person is still on the run. But Iran doesn't just blame six individuals for the bombing. The Zahedan attack is not an ordinary one. It is a dangerous strategy that aims at hitting Iran. The sons of the Revolutionary Guards are standing firm in the face of the harbinger of doom triangle that consists of the Zionist entity America and Saudi Arabia, which is a symbol of evil in the region and the world. Pakistan has condemned the attack and offered cooperation. The Iranian military is demanding Pakistan cracks down on Jaysh al Adil and warns if it doesn't, it might take action itself. Victoria Gatenby, Al Jazeera.